Um, as far as resistance training goes, um, obviously what it does is improve your strength, improve your muscle mass, increase your muscle mass. And that is very important. Um, and there are several reasons for that. One is that muscle is a metabolic sink. Um, most of your metabolic activity goes towards your skeletal muscles and by improving their fitness, by improving their strength, you uh, can increase the size of that metabolic sink. You can um, improve your metabolism overall. So for overall health. Uh, another reason is that uh, as, as we age, we lose muscle. This is pretty universal. So um, this can be detected as early as, you know, by, by the time someone is 30, they have detectable muscle loss. Um, and as each decade goes by, this muscle loss actually accelerates so that by the time somebody is quite old, say about the age of 80, they can have lost half the muscle mass that they had when they were younger. And that is really a disaster uh, in terms of health. Um, it, it leads to, for one thing, um, worse metabolic health, diabetes in extreme cases. Um, and, and so from that point of view, it's, it's definitely bad losing muscle. Another reason is that as people get old, um, they become frail. So in, in, again, in extreme cases, when someone's very old, it, it really not even necessarily in extreme cases. Uh, this, this happens to people who aren't even that old. Um, they can be so weak that they cannot do their normal activities of daily life. Um, again, in an extreme case, maybe not even get out of the chair they're sitting in. Um, uh, you know, and when that happens, people need assistance just to live their daily lives. They need somebody to help them. That's the sort of situation that can often end in a nursing home, uh, you know, because they, they just have to be taken care of all the time.